This video is going to look at making predictions based off of some data that's already been given to you from a previous experience. We're going to think, what would happen if? The first example we're going to look at, it says, Dana found the experimental probability of her making a bullseye when throwing darts is two tenths, or it's 20%. So she makes a bullseye 20% of the time. Out of 75 throws, about how many bullseyes could she predict to make? So what we're going to do is, normally she makes it 2 out of 10 times. And instead of only going 10 times, it says, hey, if she shoots or throws 75 arrows, how many times should she get right here in the center to make a bullseye? Now this question supplies you with the fraction and the percent. So you get a choice which way you want to work this out. I'm going to show you how to do both of them on this one. If you have the fraction, the way you're going to set this up is, or one way to set this up would be, I'm going to make it 2 out of 10 times, and now I need to try and decide how many times I would make it out of 75. One way to solve this that I previously taught my class to do is to look sideways or diagonal and multiply those two together. Um, 2 times 75 is 150. And then I need to try and figure out what number I would times with 10 to get 150. If you know that, awesome. If not, then you would divide 150 and 10. And the answer would be how many shots she would make. Now that would be the amount of bullseye she would make. She would make 15. So now let's say you wanted to use the percentage to solve the question. This would be another way to do it. I'm going to take the percent. I'm going to make it a decimal. And then I would times it with the total number of throws she's going to make, which is 75. I would times these together. I'm going to get the same answer, but I'm just going to show you. 75 times 0.20. When you work it out, it's going to be 15.00. And these two, they end up being the same thing. Either way you do it, you get the same answer she would make 15 bullseyes. I should not have said arrows. Those are totally darts. She's shooting darts, not arrows. Next example says, a car rental company sells accident insurance to 24% of its customers. Out of 550 customers, about how many customers are predicted to purchase insurance? Now, this question only gives us the percent. So instead of me setting up a fraction, I'm just going to do this the percent way. And net, I know the total customers are going to be 550. Thinking back to that last slide I just showed you, I'm going to take the percent. I'm going to turn it into a decimal. And then I'm going to times it with a total. 550 customers total. 24% of them are going to buy insurance. I'm going to make that a decimal. When I work this out, okay, that is. 13200, zero, zero. but remember that um, I have two digits behind the decimal, so I'm going to have to come down here, put in. My answer is going to be 132 will purchase insurance. Wow, that's kind of messy. 